want to ask you also when you said you know out of the uh, box thinking you d- it wasn't like it was a simple thing instead of wow yeah let's get it to colombo mm-hmm. uh, it was not ground breaking it was not a big you know exactly. revolution with it's, it's it's a very minute thing mm-hmm. i also want to ask you this question you, when you were the commander of the air force i'm pretty sure under your command there were muslims there were tamils there were singalese there were burghers there were multi ethnic uh, people trusting you to for, towards leadership uh, how did you make them feel that they they're part of this big story uh, the tamils are not the tamil person is not fighting against a tamil person they are fighting against a terrorist a muslim person is not fighting against a muslim yep. you're fighting against a terrorist and this is very important because uh, in sri lanka culture religion is embedded in our in our, in our blood uh, how much ever the west is telling us you know so primitive thinking and all those things it is not the case we we still care about our family we care about our religion we care about all that so now there's a massive challenge when you have all these people for them to act as one unit how did you do that actually mahesh uh, the chief of staff was a tamil gentleman <coughs> I think he passed away about two years ago due to COVID in the UK. Then my director planning was a Tamil gentleman. Then we had um, two or three fighter pilots in the Mi-24 squadron who were Muslims. But then we were united in one accord because of one cause to fight this. So that, I mean, those, there were cultural differences in our religion and things like that. But then those did not deter us because there was a vision set before us by the leadership of this country and the military leadership to hold of this vision forward put, put it down to our second level third level leaderships and it was one huge massive like a tsunami like a wave i mean we went forward so it was a united effort your language or your religion or to what ethnicity you belong did not matter at all actually having a number 2 yeah. as a tamil gentleman somebody would have asked uh, well, is yeah, that a security I, concern <laughs> yes i said no not absolutely uh, no concern at all it, it didn't bother the present president or the secretary of defense as well so because we have a focus on something else we were i mean we were we were thinking of that i mean that is why i think that's also one of the successes and then mahesh uh, uh, other than the military everybody got together it was one huge positive force moving forward even the media was positive even everybody you take a school principal he was with us you take a little child he was with us why did this happen i think i i, I might be a little critical of the media maybe on later things <laughs> because they were very supportive and they showed all the positive sides of this they could have shown some negative things yeah. and dwelled on negativism so that everything would have had a negative effect but no they everything was positive from the president down to the last soldier the media covered it in a very positive sense and then a positive message went out so much so that every other country was interested to know what was happening sometimes um, um ambassadors is to come into my office because we had the uav photographs live and they is to come and see what is happening there because uh, this positivity was created and we were moving very fast of course they are also in parliament there are certain people who yes. said madhavachi and all these yeah. things but then maybe uh, but that particular it, voice was drowned because the positivity yeah. on this side was so loud it was so loud and so that's why we managed to do this i can give you an example of uh, our cricket team did you ever think that we will bring the world cup here when they went there i don't think anybody believed but the captain did a wonderful job and everybody else in that team did a wonderful job and they played as a team and everybody concentrated on the positivities maybe kaluvitar and would have been a short uh, boy but then we concentrated on his batting prowess his wicket keeping ability and then that came out very powerfully he supported 
Jai Guru Mandir Mandir was a Tamil. And he was yeah, that's right. So that was a very positive team performing positively against impossible odds, no? And then our media showed every positivity there. They could have shown negativities of players and destroyed that. No, media has a very important uh, uh, part to play in almost everything regarding a country's progress. I think uh, that's what I wanted to bring out in this cricket team issue also. So they won the cup, and it's been still talked about. So I mean, uh, for you to move forward in a vision, everybody must move positively uh, and as a team.